Assalamualaikum guys Today me and my family we're going to travel to Manchester inshaAllah We're going to watch my first game in Old Trafford Alright bismillah And it's against Chelsea So yeah inshaAllah it's going to be a big game Hopefully it doesn't disappoint Come on Just got to the train This is the East Midland train I think, this is a new, I think this is a new train This is so nice So comfortable Much more comfortable than the bus so if you guys are travelling, a lot of travelling and you guys want to train, you should get a real card. Yeah, it goes up to 30% of, I mean 30% discount. So yeah, you should definitely check this out. So that for Sheffield, uh, we, train, we change trains. This train is not as nice as our previous train. But luckily, I, I don't mind. As long as we get to Manchester, can't wait. Man. Yeah, can't wait. Can't wait to watch the match. Okay, guys, I just got to Manchester. I'm at uh, Manchester Oxford Road stop, and it's raining. Alhamdulillah. I was telling my wife that whenever it rains, it usually becomes a really epic match. But you know, when you have to go to the stadium in the rain. I don't think it's going to be that much fun, but I saw that wrong. Uh, Alhamdulillah, we just got in. It's our first time staying in uh, Premier Inn. So we just wanted to change a bit. And then the same old Holiday, Express, Holiday Inn Express. So, well, the room seems quite nice and quite modern. It's a bit smaller than um, Holiday Inn Express, but most of the stuff here looks brand new but I guess this hotel is quite new as well so yeah, makes sense okay guys, I'm ready to go it's my jersey you know the reason I'm wearing this is because it's raining I, I really wish I didn't wear this but inshallah I'm gonna get to the stadium and I'll just take it off you know, regardless of the rain hopefully, I don't get wet <laughs> Inshallah, I'll take the tram to go to Old Trafford as suggested by the receptionist So I'm really excited because I haven't been on the tram since I don't know, forever I guess I can't remember the last time I went on the tram So I just bought my tram ticket You know, fortunately the tram station is like 2 minutes walk from uh, the hotel So yeah, it's really convenient So I've read, uh, I've, I've seen a video online which says that you know, to go to Old Trafford You can go by bus, you can go by tram and you can go by boat So they've They've built like a really good trans uh, public transportation just for people to go to or see the match. You know, imagine imagine like seventy thousand people going one place at the same time. Wow. Must be really, really. They must re plan it really well. Yeah. Oh, it's plenty of rain. So we are just going to the tram. You can see there's a lot of people are wearing the scarf uh, you know to see the match today inshallah so we yeah, hopefully we'll see more fans later when it goes to Old Trafford okay just uh, stop at Old Trafford Alhamdulillah although it's raining uh, it's not as cold as I expected to be so yeah inshallah I can take off my jacket later This is the Old Trafford uh, Cricket Stadium So eventually it's just uh, next to the stop from the train So yeah, you can just go in and have a look It's quite nice So I just got myself another scarf The match day scarf Manchester vs Chelsea <laughs> As you can see, everyone is just walking through the stadium for the transition. So, I think this is a very good uh, public transport system. Yeah. 
They had a small security check. Whoever that has a bag has to open it and show through security. So that's a good way to make sure that you know nothing goes wrong. Yeah. Mashallah, it looks amazing. It's huge, man. I can't believe that I'm here. You know, I wish I had all my friends with me. Who are just United fans are here with me, so I can watch them together. But yeah, I'm still happy to be here. So over there is the Munich tunnel. Uh, I want to go, but I can see there's tons of people. There's a lot of people there, but you know, let's go anyway. So this way is the Chelsea fans' way. This is the Chelsea fans' entrance. So I'm in the Munich tunnel right now, so I can see some fans are already going in the stadium. So they have another check here, so they check all the. Uh, everything between you just to make sure you don't bring anything uh, suspicious or anything dangerous to the game, you know. Yeah. In the stadium, uh, you can see that they talk about the Munich uh, incident, uh, step by step, how what happened uh, during the uh, Munich stadium and how the team, uh, how, sorry, how the team uh, recruited themselves, recruit themselves and play back again and came to the other day. So it's really interesting. show up and just see for a teammate so this is the Chelsea bus <laughs> I think they saw Mata just now so. yeah okay he comes there he is one of the noodles in so uh, they have some sort of training for kids, which is really interesting. That's good, you know, to develop the skills since they're young. So, so, there's also a lot of uh, food stalls here, as you can see people you know, selling fish and chips and everything. It's very well organized. So in case you guys don't know, uh, in Old Trafford they have uh, a tour, so a museum tour. So I've been twice on it uh, for the last uh, two visits. So I'm glad this time I got to see a match against Chelsea. So yeah. So I'm in front of the uh, Manchester United uh, Trinity, Josh Bass, uh, Dennis Law and Bobby Chalker. So okay. everyone's taking pictures here today. Okay guys, I already made one round of the stadium and you can hear all the fans are singing inside. I think it's just uh, my time to go in right now just to see what it looks like from the inside. Yeah, still have about one hour, 45 minutes to go. So yeah, let's go inside. Is the king. Okay, guys, I just got news that uh, Jose is putting up a strange team or not the team that was protect. Ibra is not starting and Mikataren is not starting. So, yeah, let's see what he has up his sleeves. I guess uh, we know we trust in our manager, so I hope to see uh, good results today. Yep, so this is where I'll be sitting, I'll be 16. So yeah, I just passed the security. Going uh, up to my seat now, oh, I'm so excited. So when you get inside, on the top, there are snacks and bars everywhere, so everyone's just drinking and you're having a snack for the game. So this is my seat, let's go, let's go have a look. 
you guys can see there's a tunnel down there the players come out I really wanted to sit down there it's cheaper and it's closer to the tunnel but I'm not sick still got a seat here back, back. so the players are just warming up you can see everyone Pogba, Fellini, Lusso, Romero, Viviari that's one of the world's best goalkeeper right now. It's warming up. So uh, I just got to my seat, so it's quite in the back, but you can see the whole game from here, it's quite nice. I'll show you guys. So this is basically the view from my seat. It's good to me.
and the roof is coming down on you. <laughs>
is dying because I recorded so much things inside. Hopefully I could record a few more things outside but if I don't it was an amazing experience. If you guys are coming in you should definitely see that it's Trevor's there. It was crazy. It was more than anything that I would have expected. Yeah. <coughs> yeah, I mean, thank you fans. Thank you Mr. Samantha. I'm back in the hotel room. Unfortunately like I said my battery died and I couldn't record any of uh, the players coming out. I mean, from the coming out from the stadium, going back to the car. And I've, I've saw a lot of players: uh, Herrera, Luke Shaw, Valencia, Zlata, and even some of the Chelsea players: uh, Gary Cahill, John Terry, uh, David Luiz, and so on. And uh, you know, it was it was really uh, amazing to see them in real life. Um, Jose is surprisingly very very friendly. He he went all over the place to sign uh, for everyone, most everyone. Uh, most of the players didn't make time for us. Uh, I think they had better things. I mean, they, I think they had uh, more important things to do. But I think uh, Herrera made most effort to mean try to please everyone. You know, after his performance today, well, he was so amazing. If you guys watch uh, the game in Old Trafford, so if you guys want to see the players coming out from the tunnel, so you should guys wait, should wait them at between south and west. Uh, stand so they be coming up from that tunnel. Yep. So yeah, I think that's in that's enough for day one in Manchester. We still have two more days. I'm going I'm going to leave on Tuesday, inshallah. So yeah, today's full day walking around, exploring in Manchester, inshallah. So inshallah, see you guys tomorrow. Sound like